Hey guys, EMP5 Reviews here. Today I've got a book that I found on eBay while I was searching for some stuff called The United States in World War I by Don Lawson. The reason I picked this up is the age on the book. It's definitely a lot older, it's a little cool, and of course it was cheaper, so I figured I'd look into it and give it a try. So, you open it up here. It says, United States in World War I by Don Lawson, the story of General John J. Pershing and the American Expeditionary Forces. Illustrated with photographs and maps by Robert Stanley. And this was published back in 1963-64. It says it's in the memory to his uncle, whose stories about the American Expeditionary Force were so important for his boyhood. So it goes through. It's just a little short thing, a little short history of World War I. It's got a few pictures and maps in there. Doughboys leaving St. Nazaree, France for a training camp. Boxcar could carry either 40 men or 8 horses and were often called side door pullmans. A couple other pictures in there. Oops. Many Yanks were rushed into battle by motor transport to stem the German drive in the spring and summer of 1918. Some soldiers on the side of a building. It's a nice little short book. Sergeant Joyce Kilmer, the soldier's poet. Some cool pictures, some cool little maps. I'm starting to like getting into all these older books. Stuff that is like 40, 50, 60 plus years old. There's a good picture of Captain Eddie Rickenbacker. Ooh, who we got here? Lieutenant Frank Luke. I think I missed one. Uh, Americans breaking through some German defenses. Picture of machine guns, some good old tanks, Yankee Doughboys attacking machine gun next, Charles Whittlesey, commander of the Lost Battalion, seen a few good movies about that, Cher Ami, the carrier pigeon that proved a dear friend to the Lost Battalion. Photocopy of a surrender demand sent to the commander of the Lost Battalion. Sergeant Alvin York. Samuel Woodfill. And that's about it. A little short book, but it's cool finding something from history. Something that's, oh, hell, 60 years old now, almost. But yeah, it's going to be interesting to have, and I'll put it in my classroom when I'm done reading it. Other than that, that's it. Please give the video a like, a share, and a subscribe. Leave a comment, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.